All right, we're back. Get ready, get ready to do my The Love of Life video blog. And here's why. According to TheBlaze.com, get your own. It says, uh, <laughs> it says, uh, according to Blaze.com, and here it is. A day without women's strike being organized by a team made it up, made up entirely men. Uh-oh. <laughs> well, guess what? Who knows? Um, here's why. The strike being organized to coexist with 2017's International Women's Day finding itself lacking a female inclusion. Oh, this is from a Washington Good night. Free beacon. Now, I want the, uh, here's here's my according to Washington Free Beacon says that um it says the leaders of of the day without without a woman strike are working with a group that doesn't doesn't not have a single female in a leadership position. And here's one of the reasons why, because the Women's March protest group is asking female employees to skip work. Uh, hello. On yeah, uh, that is today's March. Today is March eighth. <laughs> that is today's Wednesday. This why everybody draws, draws to attention. Here's the importance of female working in this workplace. Hiring discriminating against women. Oh, uh, oh, really? Huh? Here's your worst nightmare. The group action network fund is a progressive organizing, yeah, a progressive online organizing platform based in D D C. That is, you guessed it, concerned with mobilizing protest against. Oh, oh boy, here we go. President Trump and it works with all sorts of union and left-wing political po po politically based on organizers, organizations to do it. Uh, you know darn well that uh, that the Action Network Fund has, has, it's not gonna, has no right to do this. You know why? It has partnered with the major progressive groups, including the AFL-CIO and the National Education Association. And give me one of the reasons why? Because it touts its partnership with individual and a group that provides a practical guide to resist the Trump agenda. Let me put this right for you. Does anybody else know it? Does anybody else care about volunteering and supporting town hall projects just like this? Now, here he is. Hillary Clinton Heights out there. Because it's the staffers trying to encourage to show up at the town halls and progress, protest this progressive policies. And what kind of action network try to promote this? Well, Women's March, Women's March events, hosting maps to help activists located marches, um, marches in this arena. Now here's why. Here's why it organizes a protest against Walmart. Oh, Walmart. Guess what? Look what this for you. It doesn't protest Walmart, do you? Since I got this, if if I have a, since I gotta get my oatmeal, <laughs> yeah. apples, apples, apple and cinnamon, apples and cinnamon, oat, instant oatmeal from Walmart, and wow, silence, no protesting. <sighs> that hello, that what answers your question? Who knows? Now, the Action Network shares the same thing 
as Washington, D.C. addresses the change to win. How about this? An SEIU Teamsters. And labor a labor group to change the to win in a you guess guessed it James P Hofta, the president of this one, the International Brotherhood of Teamsters, and its secretary yes, Mary Kay Henry. What kind of crap? What kind of idiot crap is this? Well, guess what? It with its organization capabilities. What about the Action Network Fund to lend their services to help organizing women who who were looking to skip work like these kids are skipping school, didn't do their darn homeworks or whatever it is, and have a day without, uh, stupid. Here's the bottom line. Here is the bottom line. You, Action Network Fun, need to stop this. Seriously, you need to stop this. Progressive protesting all, all that crap of yours. Because it cannot be organizing a team made up by entirely of men. Men, and what kind of a creature habit is this? I know who did this. Mark Mark. Fleischman, Ryan Young, Jason Land, and Jason Robum Ro and Jeffrey what? Douglas, who just made that thing up? Idiotic thing up. Who all who made are male? And wise women are marching to protest this? Uh guess what? The underdogs in a male lead environment. Because you know why? It hires no em women employees. These. These to work am amongst them. Well, guess what? Guess what? I don't like this at all. Because cause the Action Network Fund is too stupid. See, that's why the that's why the progressives does stupid things like this. Oh, what about the leftists? Does stupid yeah, that too. You progressives have you progressives are being so yeah selfish. I tell you one thing is the moral the moral of this political life story is this. That the Washington Free Beacon tried to report this that the Women's March spokeswoman Cassidy Bendley didn't respond to those requests for comments about why organizations organizers are working with an all male progressive group. You see, what I tell you, just goes, <laughs> just goes to shows that a day without a woman's strike is pathetic. I just don't. <laughs> Men and women can't live with it, can't live without it. That's all. And that's my uh, <laughs> political life video blog story, and I'm sticking to it.